YouTube, what's going on? I hope you're all well. Now, very quick change. It doesn't relate to everybody. It's only specific information. Have you ever seen a green name in the actual raid lobby and wondered how the hell they got it? You're looking at a Sherpa. Now, a Sherpa position, what they are, they're dedicated individuals who are super experienced at the game, locked in a crazy amount of hours that actually dedicate their own time to help new players. So they're pretty much like a, you know, what do they call it? Tutorial boss where they will show brand new players on how to play this game A to Z. If I'm brand new again, man, I remember my first day, I picked it up and I was just like, holy shit, this is one of the hardest learning curves I've ever come across on any game. Chirp position exists for that exact reason. If I was solo and I didn't have a friend to teach me a little bit of the ropes, he was pretty much as good as me. Like, we were both brand new, two level Timmies. Um, man, if the Sherpa position wasn't around, we would have been screwed. So... Sherpas, they help all the brand new players for the changes that BSG did make today. Now, it just occurred as of a couple of hours ago. If you are a Sherpa currently, or if you're trying to apply to become a Sherpa, if you are a content creator, right? So if you do YouTube, Twitch, Instagram, TikTok, whatever your social is, and BSG cross-reference you and they check all your stuff before you actually, you know, try and apply or get the position, you will no longer be able to hold the green name or you'll no longer be able to apply to become a Sherpa anymore. Reason being, a lot of people were actually getting the green tag, doing the minimal amount of work to actually take people through and teach them the actual game itself, getting the green tag and actually just sitting in lobbies and getting some extra crazy exposure. Reason why is because if you're a green tag name or a purple, which is an emissary, when you go into a waiting lobby, you actually sit at the very top of the lobby. Now, these lobbies are global too. They're not just region locked, so you're not seeing the person of your suburb or something like that. You're actually seeing the world lobby at that point. So that's huge eyeballs on your Twitch or, you know, your YouTube handle, whatever you've got in your actual name that you're trying to promote. It's massive. So I think BSG obviously felt that that wasn't the benefit or anything like that. It's best to obviously remove content creations from being a Sherpa so that way nobody complains that they're just doing it to get the actual clout and that's exactly what happened as of today so if you're trying to get the green tag you know just make sure you don't have any channels linked to your um, BSG profile or anything like that don't put it in your application when you do so they will check you afterwards in midway and before so look it is what it is if you just want to purely help people out from the bottom of your heart this is the position for you if you want some extra clout just work harder man it isn't for everyone, it is for those specific individuals that want to invest their own time to really help people out. And I think it's a great thing to do. So for BSG to change this, good on them for any content creator that did hold a green tag. And because there are people that actually do good by the community with their green tag, with the green name, whether they do YouTube, educational content, anything like that, it is all a helping form. So just keep it in mind if you're trying to go for this position. As I said, it doesn't apply to everybody, but it's good knowledge to have anyway. So have a great weekend ahead. Take care.